reason that I call myself Pull me from the confines of my timid shout Beautiful. <laughs> you okay? I'm good. Are you okay? Yeah, great. I love your dress. Thank you. I guess it's not what I expected at all. I, I couldn't. No. I, I couldn't like picture. I don't know. You know me. I'm not very creative. So there's no, there's no way for me to. All good. Good. Friends and family, I would like to thank you all for joining us here today as we celebrate this beautiful day with Nicholas Riccelli and Demi Lennox. Now before we get started at the request of the bride and groom, they've asked you to please silence or put away your cell phones. Not to mention if you're going to record this work of art, you need to pony up. And with that being said, I take cash or Venmo and you can see me in the kitchen afterward. Sorry we had to bundle up today for this cold winter day as well. So, so we're gathered here today to join these two in the bonds of holy matrimony. Now, I didn't become close to Demi until she started dating Nick. But at that very moment, I knew that Nick's life had infinitely gotten better. Nick, on the other hand, I've had the unfortunate experience of knowing for almost my entire life. Dating back to when he would go tanning twice a week, had a blowout for a haircut, and thought he was Gordon Ramsay cooking at Guillermo's. However, for knowing him as the man he was raised to be, I know that Demi's in good hands. Now, I've been nervous for this day ever since they asked me. I thought this was going to be one of the most difficult things I'd ever have to do. I mean, this is the day that you two are going to remember for the rest of your lives. And for some reason, you chose me. But when I saw Demi walk down the aisle, and Nick's face light up and possibly even shed a tear, which he won't admit, I realized how easy this all was. And that's how love is for these two. It's easy, it's sincere, and it's true. And it's because of this true love that any obstacle that comes their way, they will overcome. In short, you two have everything because at the end of the day, you have one another. Now before I start to cry like Nick did a little earlier, let's get to the moment we've all been waiting for. Vibes, can I have the rings? Which one's this? Oh, they're both in here, okay. Nick, 
As you place this ring on Demi's finger, will you please repeat after me? You are the love of my life. You are the love of my life. For now. For now. And forever. And forever. And Demi, as you place this ring on Nick's finger, will you please repeat after me? You are the love of my life. You are the love of my life. For now. For now. And forever. Okay. Before. Okay. All right, this is my favorite part. Let's hit some I do's. Demi, do you take Nick to be your lawfully wedded husband? And Nick, do you take Demi to be your lawfully wedded wife? I do. Attaboy. <laughs> now, by the power vested in me, by the state of New Jersey, and the weird people of the internet at the Universal Life Church, <laughs> I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. Nick is everything a father could ask for, for a husband for his, his daughter. You are just everything. The love between you two, it's so easy, it's so genuine, it's so real. We all feel it. You feel how much they love each other. It's something that's really special. You two are now whole, and I'm so excited to see where the future takes you. Man, they're alive. They're, they're going to get whatever they want out of life. I love you both. Salute.